Alright, Shalom, Shalom. It's Brother Yatazadak here of Israel. I'd like to start off by giving all honor and glory to Yahweh, Bashim Yahushai, Bashim Kakodash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. Right, today we're going to go into Numbers chapter 1, going into the Hebrew. Lord will you ratify, giving all honor and glory to Yahweh, Bashim Yahushai, Bashim Kakodash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. Let's get right into it. Numbers chapter 1 and verse 1, right? It reads, Wayadabar Yahweh al Masha, meaning then he spoke the Lord to Moses, Bama Dabar Sayanaya, in the wilderness of Sinai, Ba'achal Mawa'id, in, uh, in the tent of uh, a meeting, right? Which is the proper name, but you can say literally it means in the tent of a gathering. Right, Bachad uh, Lachadash. Right, in the first of the month, Hashanayah, the second month, Bashana Shanayath Hashanayath, in the year the second, uh, Lataza Atham, meaning uh, um, from the coming out of the land of Egypt. Ma'arataza Matazarium La Amar to say Sha'awa Ata Ra'ash Kal Aidath meaning uh, bear to the heads of all the companies right because that word Aidath means company Aida or Aidath right which literally it means uh, witnesses right like scriptures say Right, we you are my witnesses, said the Lord, talking about the Israelites, right? Because that word I that means witness, the Tha makes it plural. So really it should say, right, um, bear to the heads of all the witnesses, the sons of Israel. Banaya Yasha Allah, right? La Mashapakatham, according to their clans, right? La Bayath Abatham. To the house of their fathers, right? Ba Masapar, right? In the number of their names, Shamawath, right? Call the car, all males, Lagal Gal Thumb, right? Meaning according to their head count, right? Because Gal Gal is, is another way to say uh, head count, right? Gal Gal. I believe that literally means uh, uh, that means like skull or something like that. Let's get that actually. Um, so like yeah, numbers chapter one. So like yeah, if I'm going a little quick, it's just a lot to cover because there's a lot of names that are recorded. Hence why it's called uh, the book of numbers, right? And if you study um, the book of Numbers, literally, you're going to run into uh, math problems, too. So, <laughs> we're going to deal with that as well, <clears throat> through the Spirit, right? Um, let's see. So, it says here, pulls. That is what is translated. But, when you go to the etymology of the word, um... It means um, the skull, right? Skull head pull, right? A skull is round by implication because that word is galal, which means something round, right? Could be talking about dung, it could be talking about anything round, right? Galal to roll as stones, right? So that word galal literally means to roll, right? Or something that it rolls, right? Like the head, you know, it turns and right in various directions, right? Um, <clears throat> 
Numbers chapter 1 and verse 3. Maban Ashariam, Shana, meaning from the son of 20 years, Wama'ala, Wama'ila, and up, call Yataza'a Tazaba, all that go out to the host in Israel, by Yasha'ala, Ta Pakwadwa, right, uh, meaning you will register, right, Atham to them, right, um, to their host, La Tazaba, Tazabatham, Ata Wa Aharon, Wa Aaron, right, you and Aaron, because that word Pakwad, it means to give charge or to assign, but it literally means to visit, right, but here it's in the sense of uh, them being registered, right, according to the heads of their families, their clans and their, their tribes and their clans, which is a tribe within the tribe, right? Verse 4, Wa Atakam, Hayawa, Ayash, Ayash, and you uh, will be a man for a man, Lamata, Ayash, Raash, or a scepter, right? Mata means scepter, right? For a man, uh, the head, right, Raash, to the house of his father, Labayath, Abathiawa, Abathiawa. That is Hawa, Waalha, Shamawath, Ha Anashim, and these are the names of the men, Ashar, Yaimadwa, Athakam. Which they will stand to you, right? For Reuben, La Ra'aban, uh, El Eliah Tazawar, Eliezer, Ban Shadaya Awar, son of Shadur, Lashamai Wan, for Simeon, Shalom, Shalom Ya'al. Uh, Ban Tazawaria Shadaya, uh, which is Shilumel, Shilumiel, son of Jirish Shadai, La Yahawada, Nahash, Nahashwan, Nahashan, Ban Imaya Nadab, right, which is Na Nashan, Nashan, son of Aminadab, Salakia. La Yashad Shakar for Issachar uh, Nathan Nathanala, which is Nathaniel Ban Taza Tazawayar, which is Zawar Laza Bilan Alaya Ab Alaya Abba for Zebilan Alayab Ban Kalan meaning the son of Helen, Lapunaya, that was up, uh, for the son of uh, Joseph, the sons of Joseph, La Aparium, for Ephraim, Elia Shammai, Ban Imaya Hawad, the son of um, Amihud, for Manasseh, La Manasseh, Gamal Yala, Ban, um, Padat Tazawar, which is Gemiel, son of Pedazor, Laban Yaman, Laban Yaman, Abayadan, Ban Gedainaya, which is Abidan, son of Gedeonai, Ladan Achaya Aizar, Ban Imaya Shadaya, which is Ahizar, Son of Amishadai, La Ash La Ashar, uh, Pagayala, Ban Avikaran, which is Pagiel, son of Akron, right? La Napathalaya, Achaya Rai, Ban Ayanan, right? Which is Ahira, son of Inan, Alha. Uh, 
Kwaraya, Ha'ida, meaning these were called, right, uh, for the uh, company um, uh, rulers, Nashaya'aya, rulers according to the scepters of their fathers, Matawath, Abawatham, right? Really, it's Abatham, right? Ra'ashia, Alapia, Yasha'ala, Hama, right? Heads, chiefs of Israel, were they, right? Wa'yakwach, Masha, Wa'aron, and he took Moses and Aaron to the men, Atha Ha'anashim, Ha'alha, uh, these, Ashar, Nequabwa, Bashamath, which were hallowed by name, right? Because that word Nequab means uh, to bore a hole, right? But this is in the sense of uh, designated or hallowed out for a purpose. Wa'atha, Kal, Ha'ida, and you, um, and you, all the uh, company, will be assembled uh kwa hayal kwa bahad la khadash in the first of the month right hashanaya the second month right meaning the first day of the month in the second month right wayataya ladawa al mashapakhtam right and those that were brought forth according to their clan, because that word Yalad means to be brought forth, right, or to be born, right, Labayath Abatham, to the house of their fathers, Bab Masapar, right, in the number of the names, Shamawath, Maban Aishariam, from the son of 20 years, Shana, and up, Wama Ayla, according to their head count, La Galgal Thumb, right? Ka Ashar Tazawa Yahawa Atamasha, like which commanded the Lord to Moses, right? Waya Pakwadam, Waya Pakwadma, right? And they were registered in the wilderness of Sinai, Bama Dabar Sayanaya, right? says recorded, but that's not what it's talking about. Numbers 1 and 20, Wahayawa, Banaya, Ra'a, Ra'aban. And it was the son, Ursulakia, uh, and they were the sons of Reuben, Ursulakia, and he was the son of Reuben, the firstborn of Israel, Bakar Yasha'ala, right? According to the generation, Tawalad Thumb, according to their clan, La Mashapach Thumb, to the house of their father, La Bayath Abatham, in number, Bama Sapar, Shamawath, La Galgal Thumb, according to the names of their head count, Kal Zakar, Maban, Aishariam, all males, the son of 20 years, Shana, and up. Wama Ayla, call Yataza'a Tazaba, all that went out to the host, right? Pakwad Yaham, Lamata, they were registered to the scepter, they that were registered to the scepter of Reuben, Ra'aban, were six, Shash, Shasha, Wa'arabayim, and and uh, forty, a lot thousand. Wa Hamash Ma Mawath, right? And five hundred. So it's forty, forty six thousand five hundred, right? La Banaya Shamaywan, uh, Tawalad Thumb, right? To the sons of Simeon, right? According to their generation, according to their clans, Lamashapachtham, 
Labaya Abatam, to the house of their fathers. They were registered, Pakwad Yawa, in number, Bama Sapar, the names according to their head count, Shamawath Lagal Gal Tham, Kal Zakar Maban Aishariam, Shana, all males from son to 20 years and up, Wama Ayla, Kalia Tazaa Tazaba, all that went out to the host, right? Pakwad Yaham, they that were registered to the scepter of Simeon, Lamata Shamai One, right? Because that word Ham, Pakwad Yaham is register, uh, uh, they. Because that word Ham means, means them or they. Here it means they, right? Tashai meaning nine, Wahamash, Wahamashium meaning fifty. So it says fifty, nine, thousand, a lap. Washalash and three hundred Ma Mawath, right? La Banaya God uh Thawaladam to the sons of Gad, right? According to their generation, according to their clan, La Mashapakdam, La Banaya Abatam, Bama Sapar. According to the house of his father, right? According to the number of the names, Shamawath, Mabana Shariam Shana, the son of twenty years and up, Wama Ayla, Kalia Tazaa Tazaba, meaning all that went out to the host, right? Kwad Yaham Lamata Gad, meaning they that registered to the scepter of Gad. Was uh, uh, Hamash, Hamasha, Wa Arabayim, five and forty thousand, right? Meaning uh, forty-five thousand. Washash, Mawath, and six hundred. Wa Hamashim, and fifty, forty-five thousand six hundred and fifty, right? Labanaya Yahawada, Tawaladam, my. La Masha Pacham, Slaki La Masha Pachtam, to the sons of Judah, according to their generations, according to their clans, to the house of their fathers, La Bayat Abatam, in number, Ba Masapar, to their names, Shamath, Maba Naishariam, from the son of twenty years, Shana and up, Wama Ayla, Kal Yataza'a Tazaba, all that went out to the host, but really it means all they that go out to the host, because it's called Ya Taza'a, meaning Ya meaning he or they, right? Taza'a that go out to the host, right? Pakwad Yaham Lamata Yahawada, they that were registered to the scepter of Judah was uh, Arabaya. Washabayim, uh, 40 and 70, right, meaning 74, Alap, 1,000, Washash, Mawath, and 600, Labanaya Yashakar, Tawalad Tham, to the, uh, to the sons of Iskar, those that were brought forth, or uh, Salakia, according to the generation, According to their clan, Lama Shapakhtam, to the house of their fathers, Labaya Tabatam, Bama Sapar, uh, according to the number of their names, Shamath, Mabana Shariam Shana, from the son of 20 years and up, Wama Ayla, Kal Yatazaa Tazaba, all they that go out to the host, Pakwad Yaham, Lamata Yasha Shakar, Yasha Shakar, they that were registered to the scepter of Iskar, um, Arabaya, Wahamashim, meaning 40 and 50, or 54, Alap, 1000, Wa Arabai, Mawath, and 400, 54,400, right? Lapanaya, Zebulon, right, to the sons of Zebulon, 
those their generations according to their generations them, according to their clans them, to the house of their fathers Bama Sapar in the number of their of the names Shamath Mabana Shariam Shana from the son of twenty years and up Wama Ayla Kal Yatazaa Tazaba all they that go out to the host right Pakwad Yaham Lamata Zebulan they that were registered to the scepter of Zebulan was Shabaya Wa Hamashiam meaning um um Seven and fifty, meaning fifty-seven. Alab thousand. Wa arabai ma mawath. Um, four and four hundred. Fifty-seven thousand four hundred, right? Numbers one and thirty-two. Labanaya yawasap. Labanaya apariam, right? For the sons of uh, Joseph, sons of Ephraim. According to the generation, Tawaladam, according to their clans, Lama Shapakdam, to the house of their fathers, Labaya Tabatam, Bama Sapar, right, according to the number of the names, Shamath, Mabana Shariam Shana, from the son of twenty years and up, Wama Ayla, Kalya Tazaa, Tazaba, all they, they that go out to the host, Pakwari Yaham, Lamata Aparium, they that were registered to the scepter of Ephraim was 40,000. Arabia, Arabayim, Alap, uh, Wachamash, Mawath, and 500. Labanaya, Masha, Manasha, two sons of uh, Manasseh, according to their generations, Tawalatam, according to their clans, Lamashapachtam. To the house of their fathers, Lapayat Abatam, uh, according to the number, Bama Sapar of the of the names, Shamawath, Maban, Ashariam, from the son of twenty years and up, Shana Wama Ayla, Kal Yatazaa, Tazaba, all they that go out to the host, Pakwad Yaham, Lamata, Manasha, they that were registered to the scepter of Manasseh. Uh, was uh, Shanayim, meaning uh, two, Washalashim, and thirty, meaning thirty-two thousand, Alap, and two hundred, Wama, uh, Wama Thayim, right? Because how you say a hundred would be Ma'a, right? Uh, two hundred would be Ma'athium, right? Labanaya Banyaman to the sons of Benjamin. Uh, they, according to the generations, Tawalatam, according to the clans, Lamashapakhtam, to the house of their fathers, Labayath Abatam, according to the number, Bama Sapar of the names, Shamath, Maban Aishariam from the son of 20, 20 uh, years, Shana, and up, Wama Ayla. Call Yatazaa Tazaba, all they that go out to the host. Pukwad Yaham, Lamata, Banyamen, right? They that were registered to the scepter of Benjamin was Hamasha, Washalashim, meaning five and thirty, as in thirty five thousand, Alap, Wa Arabai, and four hundred, Mawath, right? So that word mawath it just means hundreds plural, right? So you have ma'a, right, or ma'athium, which is two hundred. Ma'a is one hundred. Anything else past that, you just would say arabai mawath, meaning four hundred, as in plural, right? Labanaya dan, tawalatham to the sons of Dan, according to the generations. Right, according to their clans, Lama Shapakham, to the house of their fathers, Labayat Abatham, according to the number, Bama Sapar of the names, uh, Shamath, from the son of twenty years and up, 
Maban, Ashorium, Shana, Wama'ayla, all they that go out to the host, call ya Taza'a, Taza'ba, right? Tukwad Yaham, Lamatad, uh, Dan, they that were registered to accept their Dan was uh, two, Shanayim, Wa Shashim, meaning 62,000, Alap, Wa Shabai, Mawat, and 700, Labanaya Ashar, Tawalatam, to the sons of Asher, according to their generations, according to their clans, Lamashapakthum, Labaya Tabatam, Bamasapar, according to the house of their fathers, according to the number of the names, Shamath, Maban Ashariam, from the son of twenty years and up, Shana Wama'ila, Kal Yataza'a Tazaba, all they that go out to the host. Right? Pakwad Yaham, Lamata, Ashar, they that registered to accept of Asher was one and forty, meaning Akhar wa Arabayim, right? Which is forty one thousand, Allah, wa Hamash, Mawath, and five hundred, right? Verse forty two, Banaya Napathalaya, Tawadlatham, right? The sons of Naphtali. According to the generations, according to the clans, Lama Shapakthum, to the house of their fathers, Labayath Abatham, according to the number of the names, Bama Sapar uh, Shamath, Mabana Shariam, Shana, from the son of twenty years and up, Wama Aila, Kalia Tazaa Tazaba, all they that go out to the host, right? Pakwari Yaham, Lamata, Napathalaya, Shalasha, right? They that were registered to the scepter of Naphtali were three and fifty. Wa Hamashiam, meaning fifty uh, three. Alap, thousand. Wa Arabai, Mawath, and four hundred. Fifty three thousand and uh, four hundred, right? So as you can see, that was a, a bit of a uh, mouthful, right? But it, 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 it all said the same thing, which is why I kind of went a little fast. So Salakia, and what you can actually do is you can um, you can turn down the, uh, the uh, pace of the video if you go on your YouTube settings, right? Just if you want to uh, uh, rehearse it word by word, right? But I'm going to continue in a normal pace uh, now, right? is Numbers chapter 1 for verse 44 Alha ha pakwad ha pakwadium these are the registrations Ashar pakwad which registered Moses Masha wa Aram and Aaron right wa nashaya aya and the rulers of Israel Yasha Allah were uh, two Shanayim Ashar and ten, meaning twelve. Ayash, Ayash, Achar, a man to a man, uh, one to the house of his father, Labayath, Abat Yahweh, uh, which, uh, which they, which was Hayawa, right? Wahayawa, call Pakwadia, and were all. That were registered of sons of Israel, right? Or Salakia, and were all registered the sons of Israel, Banaya Yasha'ala, Labayath Abatham, to the house of their fathers, um, Maban Ashariam, from the son of twenty years, Shana, and up, Wama Ayla, Kal Yataza'a, Tazaba, all the, they that go out to the host. In Israel, Ba Yasha Allah, Wa Yahaya, called Hapaquadium, right? And they were all registered, or Salakia, and were all registrations, all that were registered were uh, 600, uh, Shash Mawath, Alap, 1000, Wa Shalash, Shalash. Shalashta and three thousand Alapium 
right? So it was 603,000, right? Wahamash, Mawath, and 550. Wahamashium, right? Verse 47. Wahalawayim, Lamata, Abatham, and the Levites to the scepter of their fathers. La'a, Hatha, Pakwadwa, um, were not registered in their midst. Patawakam, right? Wayadabar Yahawa al Masha la Amar, and he spoke the Lord to Moses to say, right? Ak Atha Mata, meaning, however, to the scepter of Levi, Lawa, you will not register, Laa, Tapaquad, Wa Atha, Raash, Raash, Raashum, right? And to their heads, right? Uh, Laa, Tasha'a, you will not bear in the midst of the sons of Israel, Bathawak, Benaya, Yasha'ala. Right, as in they're not gonna uh, take a census of their of their uh, head count, right? Wa atha ha pakwad, atha halawayim, right? And to the registrate, right? Salakia, um, wa atha ha pakwad, and you will give charge to the Levites, atha halawayim, al mashakan upon the tabernacle right of the uh, um of the testimonies right ha idath right because the testimonies were the uh was the law right which was put in the uh in the ark of the um the ark of the covenant right um wa'al Called Kali Kaliwa, and will will um and upon all the instruments, right? Because that word Kaliya is instrument or instruments, plural. Wa'al call Ashar Lawa, and upon all which will be to them, right? Hama meaning they. Yasha Yasha Awa, or Yasha Wa. Meaning they will bear to it, to the tabernacle, Atha Hamashakan, right? Wa Atha call Kalayawa, and to all of the instruments, right? Waham, right? And they, uh, Yasharatha, Yasharathawa, um, they will minister. Wa Sabiyab and roundabout, Lama Shakan, the tabernacle, Yachanawa, they will encamp. Because that word, um, Chana means to uh, encamp, right? Waba Nasai, right? That word Nasai means to pluck up, right? But that's in the sense of, uh, right, um, they will, they will, uh, they will dismantle the tabernacle, right? Or Salakia, um, they will, uh, let's get that actually, Salakia, I don't want to mangle that. Numbers 1 and 51. Salakia. Let's get that actually. Um, Numbers chapter 1 and 51. It says, uh, let's get that. Just so you, you get you get an understanding of what I'm talking about. Nasai, which is translated as to journey, but the root word is actually, um, because you're going to see it in other parts of the scriptures, right? In the, in the law, right? Nasai means to pull up, right? The Arabic says Nazai, to pull up, to pluck out, right? As in to remove a camp. That's why it's translated as journey. Because when you do, when you Nazai, you're pulling up, 
that which was uh, um, put down, right? That's another word to, for uh, to bear, right? Because you're not going to have that written so many times, right? Because it's going to cause confusion, right? So it says, Labad Nasai, and upon plucking up to the tabernacle, because the tabernacle had to be set up a certain way, right? The staves, right? The, uh, the pillars and whatnot, right? But it says, and upon journeying, right? Well, you can just say upon plucking up the tabernacle. And upon plucking up the tabernacle, right? Um, or journeying, right? And upon journeying the tabernacle, they will, they will, uh, they will bring down Yara, Yara Yadawa, right? Uh, Atawa to it, the Levites, Halawayim, right? Waba Hanath, and upon encamping, right? The tabernacle, Hamashakan, they will raise up Yahwayamwa, right? To it, Atawa, uh, the Levites, Halawayim. Um, Wahazar, meaning an, uh, the alien, right, meaning an outsider. Ha Korab, he that goes in the midst of it. Ya Yamath, Yawamath, meaning he will die, right. So that word Nasai means it just means pluck up, right? When times, like for example. When it's time to, uh, um, when it's time to, to, uh, to, uh, how do you say it, right? To get your things together, right? That's what it means. But it, you can just translate it as to journey, right? Wakanawa, Banaya, Yasha'ala, and they will encamp the sons of Israel, Ayash, Al, Machanawa, a man upon his encampment or beside his encampment, right? Waayash al Degalwa, and a man upon his standard, right? La Tazabatham, according to their host, right? The word Degal just means standard, right? Wahalawayam, Yakanawa. Sabiab and the Levites they will encamp around the tabernacle Lamashakan of the uh, of the um of the testimony right Ha Aidath Walaa Yahaya and there will not be indignation Quatazap upon the testimony Al Aidath of the sons of Israel Benaya Yasha'ala Washamarwa and they will keep to it uh, the Levites, Halawayim, right? Uh, Atha, Mashamar, Shamarath, right? And uh, to the charge of the tabernacle, Mashakan, Ha Idawa, of the testimony, right? Verse 54 Waish. Waya Ishwa, right? Waya Ishwa, Banaya Yasha'ala, and they did the sons of Israel, Kakal, like all, Ashar Tazawa Yahweh, which commanded the Lord to Moses, Atha Masha, um, Khan Ishwa, right? So uh, they did. Right. So um, let's see. If we can take a look at that word uh, standard, since we actually got a little bit extra time. Standard, but you don't really got to go too deep into that. It just means standard. Um, Salakia, bear with me. Um, standard. Man, man by standard. 
the goal, right? Which um, means um, a large military standard, right? Standard banner, right? You can say banner, flag banner, right? The goal, the real word is, uh, let's go up here first. To raise a flag figuratively to, to set up with banners, right? Uh, the goal, the Arabic says, the goal to cover, to cover over. Um, uh, let's see if we can get anything else. To furnish. To be furnished or arrayed with banners, right? So you know you could say uh, um, just standard. I would just go with standard, right? Because it's not really anything uh, too deep, you know. That just means according uh, to their order, you know. Because right, um, there's a term that. Uh, that uh, there's a term that is used. I don't believe in the military, but it's something to the it's to the effect of uh, right. Everything uh has to be um. How do you say it? Uh, it's another way to say standard. Actually, let's see if we can look that up. Synonyms for standard. Synonyms for standard. Uh, which uh, quality level grade caliber merit and sign right like stock right which is where you get the word um, uh, uniform or to conform something right let's get that actually um, in the etymology dictionary right not that, you know, they had uniforms and, you know, I'm not going to, you know, make a doctrine out of it. Oh, you know, they all had, they all had purple shirts, you know, that's not what it's talking about. Um, uniform, right, a one form, right, from French, uniforme, from Latin, uniformis having only one form or shape, right? So he's standard, right? Um, so you get the point, right? So this is uh, Numbers chapter one, uh, going into the Hebrew, it's by the Atazadak Yeru Israel, Lord willing you were edified, giving all honor and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim, Dash. So like it, double honors to the elders and apostles, a great millstone. Kwame Asha Allah, Abba Shalom.